Hi Aquarius. Aquarius? Yeah, Aquarius. Aquarius? Aquarians. Aquarians, this is going to be for your love relationship for end of June, starting from new moon in Cancer for one whole month of the cycle until the next new moon. End of June, new moon in Cancer. Okay, new moon in Cancer. Uh, love relationship for Aquarius. Aquarius. We would start off with a yes or a no question. Yes or a no. So if you have got a question, take a pause in the video. Think about it, what your question is. Before I before I reveal what are the cards saying, is it a yes or a no? Court cards are a no. Court cards meaning page, knight, queen, king will be a no. Board number 1, 3, 5, 7, 9 will be a no. Um, even number 2, 4, 6, 8, 10 will be a yes. And with the major arcana cards like emperor, uh, magician, fool, the moon, the star, all this will be a yes card. Oh my god. Apologize for that. So, um, so let's do a five card. We'll get a five card and see how many cards is a yes, how many cards is a no. For Aquarius love relationship, Aquarius love relationship, for end of June starting from new moon in Cancer. New moon in Cancer will be probably about 23, 24. Can't really remember, but it's just around there. Alright, so that's for Aquarius. Aquarius, five cards. Can I do a one last shuffle, please? Because the last it got jammed. Okay, so five cards for Aquarius. Yes or no question. Okay. It is a yes, but it is not a strong yes. So, uh, let's see. So, what do we have on the table over here? We have got eight of cups. Stuck. Not able to move forward. Not able to pursue. Not able to pursue. Because this, in an upright position, if you have to, please take a pause in the video and take a look at the card and see what signals or how do you view the card as. Whatever, whatever, if you see the moon and the stars and you feel that it's hopeful, please take it as it is because that's how we do it and that's how I do it, okay? But, uh, yeah, so take however it resonates because all different kind of, kinds of questions the viewers could be having will be like, can I trust this person? Can I leave this person? Should I leave this person? Uh, should I pursue this relationship? Uh, is this relationship healthy for me? Things like that. So it's a million, a thousand and one questions. So take however it resonates towards your own question. This in an upright position is someone is going ahead, is moving forward, leaving behind the cups, the emotions, leaving behind the past, going forward to pursue, pursue for more. Overseas could be overseas. Okay, but yours happened in a reverse. This is eight of cups. In a reverse position someone is stuck maybe something is stuck something is not fulfilling it may not be fulfilling stuck and all these cups in reverse are pouring out they are just pouring out all the emotions are pouring out heartfelt words are coming out not able to contain just stuck even the moon is laughing at you even the moon is laughing at you. Something like that. Okay? The next card we have got the six of sword in reverse. You want to go far in this relationship? You want to go a distance? Or should I travel to meet my long distance relationship partner? Should you? This is a yes card. But this is in reverse. I feel like if that's the kind of question, if this is a six of sword in reverse, it's asking you to not go all the way out not go all the way out you can you can suggest you can initiate that but from there on who is going to pay pay for the air ticket who is going to pay for the expenses think about it okay this is six of sword in reverse maybe it's asking you to take baby steps in a relationship or if you want to pursue a new love it's asking you to take a baby step or maybe asking you to wait for a while Okay, that's six of sword. Let me show you in in upright position. This is how it looks like. Alone. Working alone. Working alone. Working on a relationship alone. In reverse, maybe there's no effort coming from both ends at all. Or 
or you could be waiting for somebody's text messages because swords are communications. It's just not coming through. Or whatever that's coming is not important. Like if you are wishing to talk to someone, someone you are hoping to have a good talk with someone. Yeah, but they text you, they text you like, how's your day? Have you have, have you had your dinner? What are you doing right now? Okay, so this is six of wands. Sorry, six of sword in reverse. The next card we have got the empress. Someone is being cool. Someone is being the empress, having the upper hand right now. Having the upper hand right now. Or someone is wanting a family, wanting to settle down. Someone wants to settle down. That's the Empress in an upright position for you. The no, why, why is there no on the table? We have got seven of pentacles. I feel like saying someone is not even thinking about it. Because for seven of pentacles, someone is standing there, not taking action, just looking at it. They could be, they could be having some plans going on, having some plans in their mind, running through their mind. In reverse, they may not even be thinking about it. Like, you, if your question is that, uh, do they miss me? The no cards here is like, they are not even thinking about it. But of course, there is a yes. The, on the table, it is a yes. It is a yes why someone is missing you, but they are not talking to you. No communication coming. No efforts. No efforts to go, to, to go the extra mile stuck in their current day today every day they'll be like st stuck and drowned in their own emotions but still playing it cool does this person miss you still playing it cool but it is a yes but no no plans no thinking they just they just yeah i mean i miss you yes i miss you but that's all i could be doing what do you want me to do okay so that's just for example, just for example. Or it could just mean finances. It's blocking them. Finances is blocking them. It's on their mind. The next card, we have got the King of Cups. King of Cups in reverse. This is in an upright position. A man full of... He has got everything to give in a relationship. He can provide in a relationship but it is in reverse this person is not able to give to give you what you wanted someone is not able to give to satisfy a relationship he's not a king anymore he's in reverse upside down the cups you think there's something in the cups when it, it is in reverse the cup is empty does he really he or she sorry i just tend to say he because i'm a female <laughs> but this king of cups when it when it when it is in reverse whatever is in a cup has been emptied out so is it genuine if this per if your question is that is this person genuine the cup is empty does he really has got something to offer to you or to this relationship the cup is empty but why is it a yes it is still a yes on the table is he genuine to you he has emotions, lots of it, stuck in it. He just likes to talk. Communication card. Playing it cool. But do he really has got something to offer? No. No plans, nothing to give. Okay, so that's your yes or no on the table. Uh, this, whatever I have just said, is just a sample example. I hope you take a pause in the video, take a look at the card carefully and see how the cards look like to you. Because to me, like the Empress is just playing it very cool. Okay, so let's move on to the 10 card spread. If you think that this yes or no doesn't really resonate with you, with your question, uh, consider consider the, the next spread, which is the 10 card spread. Oh, oh God. Okay, 10 card spread. All right, so can we have 10 cards for Aquarius? Aquarius, 10 cards spread with their love relationship. Uh, what is about their love relationship, love situation right now for Aquarius? Starting from end of June. Oh. Starting from end of June. End of June, uh, 
new moon in cancer let's just say new moon in cancer to the next new moon cycle so it will last about one month to see what do we have over here for aquarius aquarius i want to say that some of you you're left with nothing you have nothing left can you see it's all jam up some of you has been played out played out really badly played out very badly okay for Aquarius one last shuffle one last shuffle for Aquarius we'll get a 10 card 10 card spread five on top and five below and let's see what do we have for Aquarius Give me a minute to study the card and I can I will just go straight thereafter. This is quite weird for you, but I'm sure there are three, more than two party in a relationship, three. A lot of options on the table over here. We have got the three of wands, three of swords, three of cups. Someone could be not financially strong, stable. Finances could be blocking your happiness if you have got the money you will have the love i said in one of the videos before no money no honey okay so the bottom of the deck we have again the seven of pentacles in reverse that's the bottom of the deck your general energy for the next one month starting from new moon in cancer for aquarius for you aquarius seven of pentacles that's really i feel like saying there's nothing you can do about it there's really nothing you can do about it in your current relationship if you have got one or if you are single, you just have to work on your finances. You either has got no option on your plates, on your hands right now. You have no one. Or if you have got someone, this someone has got someone else as well. Someone else's as well. Many, many, many. Okay, starting from the three of cups in reverse. This one came out for you. Three of cups in reverse. This is unhappiness. I feel that someone is not feeling happy. Could it be you, Aquarius? Someone is not happy because this is a card of celebration. Three of Cups in upright. Okay, but it happened to you in reverse. Today, I feel like saying someone is just not happy. Three of Cups. There's no celebration, unhappiness over here. And with that unhappiness, we have got the world in reverse. Now that I'm saying the world is in reverse, I feel like saying the world is upside down for you, Aquarius. The world is upside down for you. For your love relationship could it be in a mess messy when i say messy why it, it could be there are many options someone is having many options and that may cause if it's your partner who's having many options then it's causing you your role to be upside down you're not achieving not achieving what you are wanting for yourself not able to you're not someone is not happy or someone is not making a decision because three of cups in reverse they just can't decide who could it be you Aquarius because sometimes Aquarius in some saying in some saying Aquarius can be quite flighty so could it be you Aquarius so if you are please uh, don't do that karma that's this word karma check it out from the dictionary what does karma means <laughs> okay so the wrong the next card we have got the page of Cup, oh sorry, Page of Pentacles in reverse. <sighs> no finances, no money. We're not even a Page of Pentacle in upright. This person at least has got the capability, has got the capability to earn at least something, to get at least something. But this is in reverse. What do you have? You have nothing. You're not even 
not even comparable to a young inexperienced page. This is this pinnacle over here is like a shield. You don't have a, a cushion. This person has got a shield, but this is in reverse. Do you? How is your finances? Financially strong? How is your finance financial ability right now? Your or your partner? Someone is just I want to say broke. Broke. I will show you why in a minute. So anyway, take a pause in the video if you have to. Reverse for you. Below, beneath that page of pentacles in reverse, again, we have got the same card coming. Six of sword in reverse. Because there is this reverse of pentacle, reverse page of pentacle, six of sword is in reverse as well. No money, no honey. No money, no talk. No money, no talk. Communications, swords are communications. It's not coming through. Expecting a text from someone is going to be quite tough. Even if they do, it's not going to be targeted on, on or about um, the, 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 the more important topics, the more important subjects. Okay, so that's below, below the page of pentacles. We have got the six of swords. Not progressing because this six of sword supposed to be progressing, moving, moving away, moving far, traveling, working on it, but it is in reverse. You can't even work on it. No one, no one can work on this. No one can help this situation. This is in reverse. Okay. The next card we have got the three of sword. Reverse. Not deciding. Not able to decide. Options are on a plate. In the upright position. This is how it looks like. In reverse. This is for you. Three of sword. Someone is probably chatting with many... Multitasking. Multitasking many party at the same time. If it's a if it's a third party relationship, if if it's more than just you and your partner, they could have someone who's more who's in a better who's in a better financial stability than you. Financial financially, they are better. Or with this, because they have this six of pentacles in upright position, sufficiency, they are able they are able to play. And that's why they are playing. Three of sword. They are playing. They're not deciding on one. It's in a reverse position. Then the next card we have got six of cups in an upright position. This card is supposed to mean fulfillment, contentment, satisfaction, loving on starting a new beginning in the in the in in the relationship because this is six starting to work on it not exactly a beginning like a 10 but this is six is after it, it, it has passed five so you have come through someone someone or this relationship may have come past come through from a financial uh, situation before okay this is an upright position for you Then below beneath card we have got the Queen of Pentacles in reverse. Queen of Pentacles in reverse. Let me show you how it looks like in the upright position. This lady has achieved. She is strong, independent herself, but in reverse. Today I feel like saying independent. Someone is not independent or is being dependent. It or is being dependent, not being independent. Being dependent. On someone not strong not financially strong let me come back to this card because this two card we have got the satisfaction over here six of cups satisfaction but or maybe someone is leeching on someone they are happy because they are leeching on someone they are dependent on someone depending and dependent on someone and there is this happiness card. Someone is leeching on someone. Either one of you. Or there could be 
three party, four party relationship because someone has got the money. If they have got the money, or if you have got the money, if they have got the money, you will leech on them or they will leech on you if you are the one who's the six of pentacles, who has got sufficiency. Okay. The last set of card we have got the three of wands. Again, it's about options, choices. Many, um, they have got many, uh, many things going through their mind. Many girls, many, many boys, men going through their mind. But they ultimately have got one because they, he's holding on to one, one on his hand. Okay, this person can decide. This person can decide, but provided there's communication coming through. This is the King of Sword. He's holding the power to communicate. He will be the one who will be directing the director of the relationship. He will direct. So if you want to settle down in a relationship, if you want to, if there's something, there's a hiccup, there's a obstacle right now, there's some kind of like three party or four party. Someone needs to talk about it. Make a decision to choose. Choose and move forward. But with that, you have got to talk about it. Okay? King of Swords. So that sums up for your 10 card spread. Uh, I try to do short, but it's still 21 minutes. My God. Okay? Um, let me know if you have got any... Uh, if you have got any... Uh, questions about the cards like how why put it in the, the comment I will not yeah put it into the comment and then let's see how I probably will reply from there okay thanks Aquarius bye